Yo, what's going on YouTube and welcome back to Gold Line Hockey. It's your boy Kevin Forte and today we are taking a look at John Klingberg of the Anaheim Ducks, at least at the making of this video. John Klingberg is a pretty good defenseman, but a lot of people, again, he's taken a lot of heat for his lack of defensive capabilities and you know it's been a little bit of a rough stretch for him he kind of takes a prove it contract with the Anaheim Ducks kind of betting on himself a one-year deal and is hoping to get maybe traded somewhere at the deadline and maybe cash in again next summer and that's kind of what we're looking at here so John Klingberg we've already seen that he signed his contract with the Ducks his current salary one year seven million dollar cap hit he signed a one-year deal with the Ducks and so far, he's put up two points in seven games. He's already a minus five, though, with the Ducks. But again, this is a struggling Ducks team that only has one win to their name so far. Oh, excuse me. Um, so to say the least, it hasn't been a great start for him. And he hasn't picked up a point um, in the past five games with the Ducks. He's been averaging between anywhere between 17 to his season high so far 24 minutes of ice time so he's kind of been all over the place um but this is a guy that typically again you look at his eight years with the dallas stars he was averaging a pretty good point total he was a guy that can give you you know he gave 374 points in his tenure with the dallas stars so he's a guy that can produce but again when you look at the his defensive capabilities it is a little lacking you know his first couple years in dallas he was a plus five his first year a plus 22 again you have to look at the context of the team that dallas stars team in 2016 was pretty good um but really for the past four years now he has been a minus a minus 10 in 2020 2019 2020 in 2020-2021, he was a minus 15, minus 28 last year, and a minus 5 already this year. So, again, it's one of those things where just a few years ago, he got he got Calder votes, he got All-Star Game votes, Lady Bing votes, Josh uh, Norris Trophy votes, but he's kind of fallen off since then. His prime of his career was really those first five years. He was really solid, and he's kind of dipped off since then. And I think everybody looks at the name John Klingberg and still kind of fantasizes about that time in his career. He just hasn't really been that. So there's a chance for him in Anaheim with that ice time of basically 22 minutes averaging to really get something going this year to cash in next summer. And this is from Darren Drager. We're already hearing reports about his future. Again, he signed a one-year deal and will be a UFA next July 1st. John Klingberg could be a trade deadline option for the Canucks. Now, I think that's laughable because the Canucks are not going to be going for it. I do not I don't see it. They are just in shambles and the last thing they need is a liability again on the blue line. I do not think Klingberg is their solution. I'm saying it right now. The Anaheim Ducks are ruling out extending, are not ruling out extending John Klingberg in the future yet. And that's from Pierre Lebrun. And I get that he's kind of fits the mold of Hampus Lindholm, but I think Hampus Lindholm was a more defensively sound defenseman. I think that is something that kind of hurts. I think he is a, a downgrade from what they had in Lindholm, but I understand why they would do that. But I don't think signing him long-term is in the best interest for John Klingberg or, honestly, the Anaheim Ducks. Again, I think it's okay to be open to it. Maybe things turn around and he goes off this year. But if the Ducks are a team that doesn't really look that good this year and they aren't looking that great this year so far, I don't know. I think it's going to be interesting. Now, again, they've had a lot of games on the road which obviously doesn't help. They started this season, they played the Islanders, which I missed that game. I'm so disappointed. I missed that game. Um, they lost to the Rangers. They lost to the Devils. They lost to the Bruins. They lost to the Red Wings. And then they come home, they lose to the Tampa Bay Lightning. I mean, it's been a, it's just been a really tough start for the Anaheim Ducks. But listen, I like John Klingberg. I hope he does well, but this just doesn't seem like the best fit for him. And I hope that he's able to turn that around and he proves me wrong. But so far, I haven't been all that impressed from what I've seen from him 
thus far. So guys, let me know what you think down below in the comment section down below. Do you think John Klingberg should sign long-term with the Ducks? Do you need more time to evaluate this? Do you think maybe it's just a couple games in? There's a couple bumps and, you know, little things here and there that he can fix to kind of turn it around? Or do you think he's going to end up getting traded? And I think that is what's going to end up happening. But let me know what you guys think. Um, and that's it. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you again next time.